fade into the next song, which is audio production, which is a jingle. So when it's on auto, it will automatically work through all of this playlist. So if you're walking around the Union building and Scratch Radio is being played through the building but no one's in there, that's why. It's because we've got the computer doing it and it's on auto and it's going through all the songs and stuff. That's why we've also loaded a few jingles in here because when it finishes that song, it'll go into that jingle, then it'll go into that song. Uh, so it throws in a few jingles as well. So when you're presenting a, a show, you want to press it again so it turn, comes on with MAM, which stands for manual. Then you know when Deep Dish is finished, it'll stop. So if you remember it as being the single and continuous mode that we've got on the CD and the mini displays. So at the minute, it's on MAM, which is single mode, which means as soon as it's finished, as soon as the song's finished, it'll stop. But on that, it's on auto mode, which is kind of like continuous. So as soon as that song's finished, it'll go on to the next one. Does that make sense? This is this is the playlist, right? So it's got all the latest new songs that we've got in our current playlist. But you wanted to play uh, a Scissor Sisters track from last year. You can search for it in our library. You click on Lib2000, that's our library. You click on that, and you can search for whatever artist you want. So what do we say? Scissor Sisters. We type Scissor, and it comes up with, and we've got four Scissor Sisters songs in the uh, thing. And you know that one's a power. So if you wanted a version of the Scissor Sisters songs that's not got the intro, if you wanted to talk over the intro, you know not to play that one because uh, that one's got the jingles all over the top, but we haven't got the other version loaded up, so you'd have to bring your own or whatever. But, um, yeah, you just need to remember that, that power means it's got a power intro. But, um, <laughs> so, yeah, you can just search for whatever you want. So if you want Kaiser Chiefs, put in Kaiser. And then if you wanted to insert that into, if you wanted to play the Kaiser Chief next. And firstly, if you wanted to listen to it about it going on air, just to check that it's the right song. You heard a song on a, in a nightclub last night, and you really liked it, and you think this is what it's called, you click play and that will audition it again in the jingle mode, just like the audition there, you click play down here. Just in case you want to listen to it. That is then the song that you heard in the club last night when you were pissed off and you now want to play it on air. You highlight it and you, you, you hold the uh, left hand button down and you drag it into the playlist and you can see it's turned into a bit of a plus. And it's now appeared in the playlist. So we can either kind of hide that out of the way or close it down. And it's there now. And now if we want to play that next, we click change and next. The change bit is the song that's going to come next. It just kind of jumps it. So now we've got Kaiser Chiefs, Every Day I Love You Less and Less. Right. When that song's finished, if you want to do a bit of talking, but then after that you want to play Sugar Babes, again. Um, so we've got Kaiser Chiefs in there now. When that song's finished playing, you then you might talk. And then after that, you want to play Sugar Babes. If you could change, when the Kaiser Chiefs finished, it will jump. The Sugar Babes will automatically load, ready for you to just hit play. Does that make sense? So kind of like okay, so. I've, I've mainly gone on how to listen to things without going on air. Firstly, we better just queue up the computer and check the levels on the computer. The jingles and the music are exactly the same as on the CD player. So if we press play on the Kaiser Chiefs, or is it yeah, Kaiser Chiefs? Is playing through the comp one which is queued up. We need to make sure it hangs about four and a half. Now you remember at the, at the start of that song, it wasn't four and a half, but that's because it, so you want to wait till it starts kicking in. So it's at its highest mode, which is probably that bit there. So there. So that's already done for you. Because all the songs, because there's, you know, producers get paid millions of pounds to get these CDs at the same levels. So once you've done the same with most CDs, once you've kind of got the level right on one CD, they should be the same on all the other CDs. Unless, of course, you've got an old CD. I tend to find some of the older CDs, like 70s CDs, um, are a little bit quiet because obviously the technology wasn't as good back then. And um, some downloaded songs as well. If you download a song, the copy um, might be crap. Um, but I should say at this point, don't download a song uh, and play it on air unless you paid for it, unless it's legal. That should also be five and a half, so it's probably a little bit quieter. Now you can turn your radio without being embarrassed. Scratch Radio. Scratch Radio, great music for a great city. This is the What's On Bed. If you play the first one, it will play through the jingle fader on the desk. And it, uh, you'll notice when it's playing, 
the uh, the thing is flashing. That means it's playing at the minute, and it's counting down. So we've got four minutes and forty seconds left of this bed, and we're going to bring it down on the fader just so I can talk over the top of the bed nicely, so it's not peaking out. So all my levels are reaching about six at the minute, about five six, which is quite right for when I'm talking. About five and a half is the levels of your volume. And then when I'm finished, I'm going to press the outro of the uh, what's on, which is on the desk. That'll be playing through the computer fader. And then I'll fade out the jingle, which has got the bed on right now, so it'll all sound quite smooth. So if I start to fade out the uh, what's on bed as I'm finishing what I'm about to say, and then I finish by pressing the what's on outro on the computer. Stan, do you know how to play a mini disc? Do um, you know how to play a CD? Yes. Do you know how to play a, a song off this side? Yeah. Do you know how to play a jingle? Yeah. Do you know how to cue it all up before it goes out on air? And yeah. to get the levels right? And you know how to play it and everything. Uh, so what we might want to do, is we might want to play this song next. We'll play that. Wait, I will say, okay, I'll say. We've just come in the studio. This song's playing and we're taking over after this song. We've got a minute and 16 seconds left. So in that time, before this song finishes, we want to work out what our next song is going to be. What is our next song going to next be? So if we queue up the computer because you want to play a song off the computer, we're going to play the Kaiser Chiefs next. So we queue up computer, and we have a play. So that's the song we want to be. That's uh, 14 seconds long, the intro of that song. So now we find a jingle that's under 14 seconds long. We'll pick that one because that is 14 seconds long, so that should time nicely. Although this has got... Um, it would be nice to have a dry one, but we haven't got a dry one, so I'm just going to bang that in. So then we have a listen to that. Yeah, that sounds fine, the levels are fine. So we have these on, and we've got it faded up. This is going out live, we've got 29 seconds left. At the end of this song, we're going to hit that, and that's going to play through this fader. We can either use our mouse, or we can hit it with our finger. At the same time, we're going to play this song, so it times in nice. But so it's not too loud, we're going to bring it down a bit. So when this song finishes, Another song you might want to realise is a lot of songs finish about five seconds before the time takes, so use your ears and your eyes. And community radio. So I press that with the mouse and then use my hand to press play on the song. So they're both kind of playing now, but I fade this down. So towards the end of this, I just fade it up. Sort it. So that's how you would do it. Um, A lovely song, Mr. Robbie Williams there, and that one's Love Light, released on the 13th of November. I love that tune. Scratch Radio, great music for a great city. Go online if you want more information about our fantastic giveaway. You could win £100. Scratchradio.co.uk <laughs> Scratch Radio, great music for a great city. Coming up for you in a couple of minutes, traffic and travel. Get you home safely this afternoon. In the meantime, a bit of razor light, golden touch. Scratch Radio, great music for a great city. That one, brilliant song, I love it. Golden Touch. Trunk and Travel on the way for you shortly, and then Benny will be taking over from free. This is Scratch Radio, great music for a great city. Mr. Robbie Williams now, Love Lights.